Megan here from Adult Services. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make one of my family's favorite summertime smoothies. Three simple ingredients. It takes about two minutes to throw together. Healthy and delicious. Here's a book that I've enjoyed having during quarantine. It's been in my house the whole time. And lots of really great smoothie ideas in here. Some with different ingredients that you wouldn't have thought of to put in a smoothie. And this is available both in the library and through Overdrive as an ebook. So check that out. So for our smoothie today, I have my blender and I've measured out some water. So we start with just regular cool water. And next I have two peeled oranges. Just pop those in whole. And this depends on the um, strength of your, your blender. So I like to use frozen fruit. If your blender doesn't do great with frozen fruit, you can always use fresh and add ice to make it a little more uh, cool and summer refreshing. So here I have pre-measured out about a cup of frozen strawberries and half a cup of frozen mango. An option here instead of the mango, maybe you don't like mango, maybe you don't have mango, I use often frozen pineapple, but we are out of that today, so I went for the frozen mango. So pop all those into your blender bowl, and that's it. Three ingredients and perfect, healthy summer smoothie. I'm going to blend this up, and I'll show you what it looks like. that I want to share today is a green smoothie, which is my go-to breakfast or afternoon snack smoothie. And for this, I prefer plant-based milks, so I use, uh, this is a macadamia nut milk. We also have almond milk, but you can use regular, any kind of milk that you like, skim milk, whole milk, whatever you prefer. So measure a cup of milk of your choice out, pour that in the blender bowl, and for this, I take two cups of raw spinach, pop that in as well, and next, nut butter. And these are both pretty low, so I'm going to get about a tablespoon, between one and two tablespoons of nut butter of your choice. I like peanut butter and I like almond butter, and they're even better when they're mixed together. So the last and final secret ingredient for this is frozen bananas. Take a banana and peel it, chop it up, put it in the freezer for a couple of hours. And then you're going to get these nice solid chunks of banana. Pop those into the smoothie bowl. About one whole banana is just right for this recipe. And I have all my ingredients here. I'm going to measure out the peanut butter and then I'll blend this up. It's a perfect balanced breakfast. You've got your veggies, your fruit, and your protein all in one. I'll send a picture of this because my blender is terribly loud. And the recipe's available, and I hope you enjoy these smoothies. <laughs>